Hello. It's been a while since I've done a video. Um, and I wanted to show a haul video. Well, it's from Big Lots, Dollar General Store, Michael's, of course, and Target. I believe that's it. Okay. Well, I'll just go ahead and start with what you're looking at this little cute and this a cute tote adorable adorable little tote I just thought it was so cute I don't really need it but it was cute uh, from Target no I'm sorry Dollar General Store for a dollar and then I have two grandbabies as I've said before Blake is one and he likes Mickey Mouse it's one of his things he likes and this is a little fun pack for a dollar and it's got a little activity book and some stickers and some crayons. And I don't know where to put it. Okay. <laughs> and then here's the Minnie Mouse for Kenzie. Same thing. Dollar. Well, that's the lid. Okay. And then I got this. Let me get it out here. This little, uh tote this was two dollars and obviously there's the lid purple my color and just some baggies uh, storage bags those go elsewhere but I just haven't put it up because I wanted to do this and I don't know if I have a glue gun or not but I just got me in it's just a three dollar glue gun I've noticed that a lot of ladies use them so I figured I'd give it a try I've had them before, I just don't use them. And then, of course, bag of the glue sticks. That was also a dollar. And the other thing was uh, uh, the gun was three dollars. And then, um, spoon for Kool Aid. Um, oh, Walmart haul, too. Uh, not too much at Walmart though. Uh, this is a dollar thing. This is just all going to be kind of mixed in a little bit. But this is a dollar, one of those dollar bin things at Michael's. It's little doll dresses and stuff. I don't usually do these chipboard albums, but I thought this was cute and I'd give it a try. But this is an Easter basket at Michael's. 70% uh, off, 30 cents, what I paid for it. Here's a chick, as I like to call them, chickies, or chickadees. And then these stickers were from Target. I love these stickers. I think these are so cute. I love stickers, obviously. So I got lots of them. And then cupcake ones, because my granddaughter, her first birthday, she is now two. And yes, I have not scrapbooked that picture yet. I haven't even printed it out. Um, she had a cupcake instead of a cake. And then these owls. I am doing my church membership. And my pastor wants it done like scrapbook pages. Um, his wife is a scrapbooker. So, <laughs> so anyway, here's some animals. Love the little zoo stickers and animal stuff. And then at Walmart, I took the front off. I... I don't know if I've mentioned my other videos. I think I have, but I am just weird. I don't like to keep my papers in a pad. I like to take them apart and use them individually. Um, sometimes that's, that's that has I've been finding has been a major problem. But this I'm trying to keep together, and these are the so six by six pads I found at Walmart for three bucks. And I thought that was just an awesome, awesome, awesome deal. And there, yeah, there's 100 pages in each of these little books. This also was $3. Just really, really, really pretty. Just really pretty. But yeah, those were $3 a piece at Walmart. And then... Okay, 
these things over here this one here this bottom one was bought at Target and um, seven fifty I think or seven ninety nine or something love these things absolutely love these things I bought that one and I bought this one this one now has my washer tape in it my last video had my washer tape stuff in it but it uh sorry but I changed to this one because the opening is a lot less quiet okay the opening on this one is a lot noisier um <clears throat> those uh these ones I bought at uh Walmart well and Target I think a long time ago we're talking like three years ago or so um but I have found washi tape fits in these things absolutely perfect. And you can carry them. So to carry it across your room or carry it into another room or carry it to a crop. You just pick it up and go. Um, I did get some new washies. Like I need any more. But like a lot of ladies have said on here, you can't never have too many washies. My husband would tend to disagree with you ladies on that, but we don't listen to our husbands, do we? I don't think there's any new ones in here. No, these are not any new ones. I don't believe there's any new ones in here either. No, these are all that I've already had and I've already showed. And I'm sorry, this camera for me just goes all over the place. Okay, the new ones I got. <sighs> Can't get them out sometimes. That's another problem. Okay, this one here. And all these came from Michael's this week. So, this, um, that one there. And this one here. And this one here. Yes, I like tie-dye. Love tie-dye. Love bright colors. These two here. Together, I think. No, they weren't together, but I got them. Uh, these two were together. I love animal print. I'm not as crazy about animal print as a lot of ladies are. One of my tapes fell. Just hold on. I'm trying to get this back in here right. Okay, and then these two, these two came together, and then I got this one, and I got this one. Okay, this one was $1.49, so I don't know which ones are $1.49 still, and which aren't, and so on and so on, and I got this one here with the cool cool cameras oh upside down I think yeah sorry ladies <laughs> but oh there you go okay anyway there's all my new washi tape for the week and yes I say week and like I said I have them in this awesome storage thing and they all fit awesomely in here um the one lady um I was seeing her video last night and I keep forgetting people's names um Nate, Nate Dix uh, she does a vlog I believe also every time anyway um she has lots of washer tape and she was showing these new uh storage things that she's got and they were awesome looking and anyway okay now okay there's my big lots but I'm not showing that just yet and then I got the two dollar paper that everybody's been getting so there you go two dollar paper haunting me now 
And then this paper pad I've been wanting since I've seen when everybody was getting them for a penny. I obviously wasn't able to and you know pretty much everybody's seen them. But when sometimes when you ladies say that everybody's seen them and you don't show them, that's not always true. Because um, there's been a lot of times I haven't seen them and I know I'm not the only one. So as the person who likes to see everything, please show your paper whether you think we've seen it all or not. I'd appreciate it. Okay, and then this other paper pad that I really, really wanted uh floral foliage not real big into butterflies and flowers and all that but this was just so pretty i mean so pretty beautiful 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 and i love glitter and a lot of this is glitter and it is just beautiful love it love it love it um if I sound out of breath today, my asthma has really been acting up this week, so I'm sorry. And I did want to, these things here, see these little tubs, aren't they just the cutest little things? Well, the purple one came three to a dollar, the pink one came three to a dollar, and I got them at Family Dollar here in our town. I'm sure there's some around, some of you may know them and some may not want them at, but then these here, this yellow one looks more like a buttercup. This is like a dull green and then a blue. Um, those came four to a piece and they were at my Dollar Tree. So, if y'all need any little tiny stories, that would be perfect. Okay, and then this here is my Big Lots. Now, I'm not going to take all the paint brushes out, but as you know, I probably got all these from Michaels. $25 for a dollar. And then I wanted to let you all know that these fibers, yarn, whatever, a um, dollar at Big Lots. You may want to check your Big Lots. These are a dollar. I got that one. I got that one. Those two were the other day. Yesterday, I got these. This one. And it says yarns mixed fiber but it's got the regular yarn and then it's got like this I don't know extra cushy six saying thought that was kind of cool looking and then here's more of a bluish one crafted me 83 would love this because it's her colors um and then got this pretty one it doesn't have the thick thing it just you know, just the, you know, the fiber type thing. And here's a pink one like that. Remember, dollar. And then I got and another bag. I'm not very organized with this, am I? Oh well. You know how that goes. We all do it. We're not perfect. We're not movie stars, so. <laughs> Even though some on there I think think they are. But that's okay. They can think that all they want. They deserve it with all the stuff they go through and things they do. So But then I got some paint. Oh, hold on. I tied it up. It's kinda hard to do that with one hand. I don't care how good you are. Um, I had bought some Marshall Stewart paints a while back and I'm telling you I do love the Marshall Stewart paints but I could not afford those this week so I did not get any but these were the two for a dollar this week but I got this pretty blue and it's called uh, winter blue and then I got this pink it's called baby pink get this real pretty green and a pistachio mint this yellow which is pineapple thought that was funny purple purple's my favorite color wild orchid and coral blush this is really pretty I tried to find a peach color and this is as close as I could get to it so um, 
Now, I think that's all the haul that I have. I wanted to kind of show you my craft area. I'm not going to go into too many details because i got too much stuff laying around. Um, but I'm going to do this. I've been wanting to do this. So let me cover you up so I can turn you here. Okay, this pink tote thing I got at uh, Walmart. Yeah, Walmart. Okay. This top drawer has all my smash book stuff and my project life as you all people call it. I don't do project life. But it has all my smash book stuff and it has my little mini folders and you know it has all that stuff. Um, but it has all my um, oh I can't think of what you call them. Anyway you see them. You know what I'm saying. Just all kinds of different things. I have some envelopes over here and things like that. File folders. Um, the second drawer has these are all my stick eponymous stickers and it is full. Um, this one here has my lace on a roll and this here is just some extra string, like, um, floss string, I guess, what you call it. Um, this is an Oreo trainer box that had buttons in it. My buttons are elsewhere, but this, these, all the string, all the string I got at Goodwill for 50 cents. And then this here has all my stickles and glitter glue don't use that much I don't know why these little things I've showed before I use a lot of inexpensive little storage things these have my twine in it so different colors and then this is uh, hold on there's some twine I got in a swap this is my photo trimmer from creative memories I love 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 Pretty memories their stuff lasts forever um, I've had that photo trimmer I know for the longest it cost me 20 bucks when I got it and I have definitely used it at the bottom there's nothing in that drawer <sighs> okay you gotta see where I'm backing up because this is my desk this is one of those old metal teachers desks back in the day um, <laughs> Um, I have always wanted one of these, and uh, my church, previous church that I had mentioned, went, uh, we disbanded, you know, we're no longer there, and us who go to that church, if there was something we wanted in the church, you know, uh, we could have it, and I wanted this desk, so I got it for free. <coughs> God has answered my prayers a lot of times and my motto is you just have to be patient sometimes be patient and it will pay off but you just got to be patient and you get it then it's meant for you if you don't then it wasn't meant for you I got a lot of stuff down here um, this thing here has all my uh, cutters my shape cutters from um, Creative Memories it also has my smaller cutting boards and now I can't get it. Okay, there we go. Um, I don't know if you can see the popcorn tin back there. They had a bunch of, uh, excuse me, a bunch of stuff from uh, grab bags. So there's like a bunch of cars and things like that. Uh, there's my sidekick, Sizzix thing, that I got at a yard sale for three bucks last year. These little buckets, uh, bag, uh, baskets from Dollar Tree, Dollar Piece. These are little things that I have painted. There's like family and some others um, for my daughter for her house. So I just haven't given them to her yet. Um, there's some bags that um, Beth and Beth Scrap Rodham had sent me. Here's a bag here that when I go on my crops I'm going to take. I just haven't been on any crops. The coat hangers, because I thought I could use them to hang my ribbon up on. 
I just haven't done it. I'm a very bad, 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 bad procrastinator, so it takes me forever to do anything. I've got some other stuff back there, but nothing really that important. Um, I'm scooting back under here. Um, honestly, I don't remember. I think those are just extra storage things with some extra paper or something in it. The yellow bucket straight in the back, right underneath that white thing, has my foamy letters in it. Yes, I have a lot of foamy letters. I love foamies. They, I, I just love them. They're awesome. Um, that white thing there is a big container. That white thing right there has some pages and pictures and things like that. Uh, the black thing right next to it, right there. Um, it's just, uh, carry, you know, you put stuff in and carry it. Um, this pink thing, I designed one cutting machine in it. I got a yard sale for five bucks last year. It stopped working on me. So I just used this container for some pictures. So it's perfect. That round thing there is an old Peppercini container from a place here called Farm Boy. And I haven't got anything in it. But I love pepper sinis. Uh, what else is on my desk? This is my chipboard drawer. I have all kinds of chipboard everything. Um, this also has my Xyron cutter, as you see. And then has my Execto knife set right there. Uh, that said, I paid $2 at Harbor Freight. Um, but that, like I said, I'm not going to go into all details. This has paper and old cards and, um, uh, my cards that people give me. This card here came from A. Otmers. This came from Cindy Four Kiddos. Um, I have a lot more, but I have just a bunch of stuff in here. I need to reorganize this again. This drawer down here has all my punches. Let's see if I, how far I can get it out. Got my punches back there. Got these here and my three help punch are there. And then I have these up here. And I'm not huge on the punches. So that's why I don't have like umpteen thousands of them. Like a lot of you ladies do. This is just my drunk door for a regular desk. Um, okay, that over there. That up there. It's something I got from Michael's around Christmas when it was on sale. This has all my little wooden things in it. And I can't never open these stupid things. I don't know if you can see all the wooden things I got in there. That's all my wooden things. This one doesn't have anything right now because I was you putting my washer tape in there, but then I changed it. This has a paper pad in it that I already did a video on, the Caitlin paper pad that it says named after my daughter. And then this is a project, filled with projects, saying that I'm doing. And then here's my paper stack storage. As you see, like I said, I usually take them all out of the pads. So I do not have these really organized in any certain thing. Okay. This is a shelf that my husband had made. These are like month stickers and uh, holiday stickers uh, like that, you know, months, years, you know, things. Here's my Bigger Fisker's cutting board that I really like. Cuts real well. This one here. This is the one that came with uh, a precision pair of scissors and a craft knife. These here are my borders. A lady that worked at a store in the mall, I'm not going to mention the store, they were going to throw these containers away. I asked her if she brought them to me to get to me. These are my uh, borders that are not done. You know, they're just plain. And then these are my other borders that's supposed to be up front that are decorated or whatever. This thing here has like my little tags and my acetate stuff in the second thing and bigger tags and stuff in the bottom. My washi tape. This is a container or a pack, whatever, that has these cards that I got at a yard sale for 25 cents. 
this thing here has all my mat stacks and as I've said I take them all apart that tall thing back here has my brushes and stuff in it diaper wipes this is a calendar um, April the 10th and it's it's heavy but it's porcelain and you just change the little thingies uh, you know, these are just little blocks um, and the months come out too like June, March and all this and there's like three of them in there anyway that um, at a yard sale for $2 last year okay I'm going to sit down again um this thing a lot of you ladies have it has my letters at the top and yes it sits this way because I have nowhere to put it up on the wall so when I need it I move my radio and I pull it out but this has my letters as you can see they're marked and then underneath just different things uh, this drawer here has bling this one here has bling uh, there at the bottom in the middle has flowers stuff like that uh, this here that everybody has I, the drawers I put some washi tape on there's not much in either one of these drawers but these are my favorite knives oh my craft knife's missing uh oh um, then these are my crazy scissors as I call them they've got all them in there there's the rulers oh sorry there's the rulers um, gel pens I got for Christmas for my daughter regular scissors Tim holds up front I wasn't gonna get any and had a little extra money and I bought a pair and I love them this is extra adhesive stuff like that this in here has my double-sided tape this in the middle let's see can we see it where to go uh, yeah down there has my glues my adhesives this has my um, gel pens from Michaels the glazed ones the one puffy ones glitter ones you know the whole thing and then there's some other pens. Uh, there's Martha Stewart writing pens. I don't have the whole set on those. I want the whole set, but I don't. I can't find them anywhere. Then a regular pencil. Uh, there's some other pens in there too. Okay, and that's about it on it. Uh, this drawer has just little makeup spongy things too that's been used. And then I got. Five of these big paper clips that Beth from Beth's scrapbooking room got me, and there's also uh, box cutters in there too. It's like three box cutters. And this has extra double-sided tape. This adhesive is called Mighty Mend It. Um, some of you may have remember it was on, uh, um, you know, one of those paid program things. Um, infomercials anyway this is what it is um, I swear by this stuff I love this stuff you can't hardly find it anymore so when I find it I get it this is my eight and a half by eleven paper and my eight by eights down here but those two top one through there I do the binder method for my stickers this has my alphabets in it this one here um, now this one's empty right now and then there's some folders that I use for different things this one has my other stickers uh, boys girls grandma grandpa mom dad uh, family um, summertime you know stuff like that this has my Christmas holidays things like that this one here is my glitter paper this little thing has my calendar and my bigger uh, cutting board and my big stickers and my bellums in there and then this one here has specialty paper and big stickers uh, there's big letter stickers right there I don't know if you've seen that or not okay and then this cabinet this one here 
This here has all my 6x6 paper and some odd stuff. Odd paper here and stuff, but mostly 6x6. Back here's all my thickers that you've all seen. This has glitter foamies and just some other odds and ends stuff. This has all my ink pads and my stamps. One drawer full, that's all I need. I don't use them anyway. Here's all my templates. Just uh, a bunch of different templates. These are, I got six of these at a yard sale for $1.50. They are Tupperware bowls. Let me tell you they have all my buttons in it. This one has my polka dots and then you got the orange and stuff and pink and so on and so on. This little thing here, big lots, there were five in a pack for four to bucks. Has all my little, little cute little buttons. Uh, trying to get back in there. Everything has to fit a certain way. And then I got my certain buttons I got from Beth. I just didn't want to put them in a you know, separate thing there. And then these are photo corner things, metal ones. And then there's some brads and different things like that. Just all kinds of different things in there. This has my glitters, my eyeballs. See my eyeballs? Eyeballs. I have lots of eyeballs. Um, these are just little extra things. There's my chalks. Little chalk pads there. And this one, just odds and ends stuff. Little stamps from Walmart and these little wedges. And this is a little binder for six uh, stick upon the stickers, but I don't use it. Then these big clips and other rulers. A lot of this stuff is not really organized anymore. For the most part, my trash can sits up front. Uh, and here is my clothes pans and some other wooden things. And there's some little uh, wooden sticks and those little popsicle sticks and um, little wooden things there and some flowers in there. And uh, yes, I use grocery stuff. It's cheap and it works. There's letters in there. There's these clothespins in here. There's some other letters in there. These are just like little things that cookies at Christmas time. Um, just all kinds of things in here. This bottom one has the bags I got from uh, Tuesday morning. My doilies. These came from a grab bag. Uh, they're foamy letters, big letters. I have sponges for uh, trying to scrape off paint. Doesn't work real well, in my opinion. My little buckets, baggies, trash bags are in here. Ugh. Okay. This has pictures. This is an old cigarette box that everybody else likes to alter, but I don't do that stuff very much. That's a basket back here with a bunch of little storage things. This has a bunch of my stickers and things like that. Oh, I'm going to get tore up because it doesn't want to lay right. And then this has all my tags and stuff, you know, tags I haven't used and, you know, things like that. The little Velman sayings. My husband's coming in here getting loud. Here's all my extra adhesives and um, basically that's what the mostly is, just extra adhesives of everything and glitter. Oh, and when I say I have 90 minutes, there's three of them there. This is my gray yellow drawer. That's everything you can imagine. Here's extra markers here. This has my pictures I like to use mainly for. This is what I keep my um, piece of paper don't throw away. This thing here has layouts in it. It just opens sideways, but I can't do it right now. This here has some extra picture frames. Just there's a bunch, and then extra paints. Here's my drawer of all my paints. 
paints. There's paint stains. These are my fibers and ribbons and all that good stuff. There's my filing cabinet. This one here has my beads and some extra tools and things like that. File folders and just some extra stuff. This door never wants open. It's got my little wood veneer letters that um, the same here that I covered up. Got this at Michael's for $2. As is, and there's nothing wrong with it. So I don't know. <clears throat> Following cabinet. My other desk. Um, that blue thing right there. That's what I have my ribbon in. Um, that pink, purple thing here. Because I have extra pens I can use over here. And just some extra paper thing. Just kind of a drunk door and then these things here are just extra doors for things my desk my grandbaby um my outlet I got it at uh, Walmart for 20 bucks I'm gonna turn you and there's my cabinet I was telling you about before and still not gonna put it show you so that's all I got right now so I will talk to y'all later. Bye.